If we could snap our fingers and onboard 1 billion people to the crypto ecosystem, it would actually be very problematic. One of the best features of blockchain technology is transparency. But transparency becomes a problem when you have a large number of users. Every transaction is public. You can see everyone's account, their balance, and even individual transfers. Imagine being able to query anyone's bank account. This is actually the current state of blockchains, which could allow bad actors to easily target those who have funds to lose. You would also be able to see how much everyone is getting paid by the company they work for. Businesses could never hide their revenue. What if you could send USDC tokens to your friend, but in a completely confidential way so that anyone looking at a public blockchain explorer can see that you sent them USDC, but the specific amount that you sent, including your total balance, is completely hidden, mimicking popular Web2 applications like Venmo and Revolut. This is the basis for a new framework that Inco calls Confidential ERC-20 Tokens. So before we dive into what Confidential ERC-20 Tokens are, let's lay out the differences between information staying anonymous and information staying confidential. Both of these together are essential to complete privacy, but right now most of the tools in the crypto landscape are focused on just anonymity, or specifically hiding who is transacting. For example, Tornado Cash is a crypto tumbler technology which allows users to hide the source and destination of certain payments through the Ethereum blockchain. However, Tornado Cash is not compliant with many regulations and it's currently illegal to use in the United States due to anti-money laundering laws. A solution to this is to build technology that's not focused on keeping the user anonymous, but instead keeping the user's information confidential. To be more specific, a tool that allows anonymity is one that hides the source and destination of funds. For example, someone sends $10 to someone else. The amount is known, but the sender and receiver are unknown, and this allows both of the users to stay anonymous, or at least pseudonymous. In work with Circle Research, Inco has integrated a novel form of encryption, FHE, into the EVM, developing a way to include confidential transactions on the blockchain. What if you could simply hide the amount sent so that the transaction looked more like Alice sent some amount of money to Bob? In this case, the users are known, but the information is hidden. And even more so, what if when your government said to prove it, you simply revealed that transaction to only them? Specifically, a confidential ERC-20 token acts and functions similarly to a standard ERC-20 token, but with four main new features. Encrypted balances. The balance of a user's token are hidden cryptographically on the blockchain as ciphertext. Encrypted transfers. Not only are balances hidden, but the amount transferred between accounts are also hidden. Delegated viewing, which is optional. The account owner can selectively reveal balances and transfer amounts for others when needed or required and programmable transfer rules, which is also optional. The founder or creator of the token can reveal hidden balances or transfers amounts at will, as well as enforce compliance rules like blacklisting wallets or incorporating transaction limits. Confidential ERC-20 tokens can be directly minted by a provider or through wrapping existing assets with a wrapper contract. So we've already mentioned the idea of hidden balances and hidden transfers. Let's discuss what that delegated viewing feature means. Confidential ERC-20s allow the flexibility of specifying the decryption rules completely on-chain. Using FHE technology in tandem with blockchain security, Inco has developed a way for the balance of an address to be encrypted as ciphertext and shared globally across the blockchain network so that anyone with the right access control on-chain can decrypt the value. The FHE technology allows the balance to be revealed by certain parties when needed as allowed by the owner or through governance. This allows developers to have the option to program compliance logics and risk management at the smart contract level to enable business and institutional workflows. For example, of course Alice and Bob would want to know how much they were sending or receiving, so they can easily check the balance of their own transactions, but what if you could also allow entities like your accountant, or governments, or auditing firms like Chainalysis to view your confidential transactions when required? Well, this is the magic of delegated viewing. Using FHE to hide the transaction amount on the blockchain, Alice and Bob can selectively share who and when their balances and transactions can be revealed to. And this is the most important part, without needing to share their private keys or viewing keys in the context of ZK payments. ZK solutions do not allow this, and if you wanted to share your private transactions in the same manner, you'd have to either grant viewing permission during the transaction approval or share your private key. 
With ZK technology, the rigidity of the viewing system makes it difficult to program compliance, meaning features like future decryption at will, and you also can't revoke access. But that's not all. Since these tokens are in ERC-20 format, they are completely composable. This means that confidentiality is baked into whatever app you're using. Whether you're sending USDC to a friend, or staking your tokens on a lending platform, or swapping them using an automated market maker, a confidential ERC-20 token allows your information to stay as confidential as you'd like. This can actually allow complete end-to-end -end confidentiality. Imagine if you're wanting to deposit $10 million into a dark pool. If you do it with your standard USDC token, anyone who is watching the blockchain can see that you did do such a thing, leaking some information before you even make dark pool trades. However, if you wrap your USDC to a confidential USDC token, then deposit these confidential tokens into the dark pool, you could hide your large transaction amount. One really important use case of this composability is confidential voting. Now users can vote using the tokens they own confidentially without revealing publicly which option they voted for, but while also allowing their vote to be counted in a total. This is not available with current ZK solutions. The composability unlocks a network effect, as previous solutions to confidentiality have required siloed structures or rigid solutions, which don't mimic the standard ERC-20 token model that fueled previous DeFi adoption. This new and exciting confidential ERC-20 technology was built in combination of Inco and Circle Research. To learn more about FHE technology and blockchain use cases, you can check out Inco's blog in the description below. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, I really hope you learned something, and most of all, I hope to see you in future videos.